Hello everyone, so this is my aquaponic aquarium. You see there, this is a 10 gallon tank with three platys, top surface. And this is uh, a pepper plant that I planted. Basically, I wanted to get my daughter a pet fish. But then um, it got too tedious where I have to clean it like every week or every uh, every two weeks to a month, and I really didn't like doing that. So I was researching online on how I don't have to do that, and I heard that an aquaponic system cleans out the water. And here it is. Um, so I made an aquaponic system using uh, clay pebbles and. Uh, Let's see uh, how many. So, this is basically a six quart uh, container. Maybe I should have made a bigger one so I could put more plants. So, now it actually has a pepper uh, fruit in it. Doing well, I think. It, uh, the fruit's too small, but the plant is, seems to be doing well. I also bought a um, uh, white um, grow light from Amazon. I use the uh, white light because the the purple one, uh, the purple colored bulbs are hurting our eyes. So, so you can see that the plant is doing pretty well, I think. And the water stays clean. Um, uh, haven't changed the water for two months now. I've had this tank for over a year, uh, but when we moved, um, so I had to take the water out and start all over. Now, second month and I haven't really cleaned it. I just replace the water from time to time, like take half of the water out and put new ones in. That's basically all I did and uh, there's no algae growth. And sometimes there will be some. Uh, so I just put like a snail in it and the snail pretty much cleans it all. and. The nutrients uh, it's absorbed by the pepper plant. So here's what I did. I bought a pump that basically sucks all the water and takes it. To, uh, and there's the the tube that takes the dirty water into the into the container right there. Let me show you the water. Come on. Oh yeah. Oh. Okay, there it is. I don't know if you can see the flowing water in there. Okay, so the water goes into the tub. You can see the roots growing here. And if you look closely, closely, the the water fills it. I don't know if I can show you. The water gets filled. Okay, you can see that it's going up. And then there's also a, a makeshift uh, bell siphon that I made. So basically when it reaches a certain, the water here reaches a certain height, it'll start draining. Okay, there it is. I think it's draining. The, see there, there's the pipe that I made. I made a hole on top of the, the lid of the aquarium and I placed like a bell siphon with a hose that drains all the water out. And once, once it gets drained and you know, it will break the siphon and start uh, filling the, uh, the tub of, with water again. So that's basically, it's a drain and flood system. So that's how the plant gets the nutrients, it cleans the water out and flushes it down to the aquarium to have clean water. So this is how it looks like from afar without the lights glaring at us. And that's basically how how it works. Uh, I'll try to make a bigger one. This is actually pretty interesting. I want one that will actually grow some veg vegetables. Alright, thank you for watching and see you next time.